the state releases its only data update of the week. Remember, it's gone to now just on Wednesdays. Uh, the state reporting 3,215 new cases over the last five days. So the average standing at 643 cases each day in Michigan. 70 more Michigan deaths reported over that same time period. Meantime, the FDA's vaccine advisory panel just wrapped up its all day meeting on the future of boosters in the United States. There was no vote at today's meeting. Instead, the FDA asked its panel of outside experts to weigh in on where we go from here. Although we've seen a major decline in the number of COVID-19 cases in the country, the virus continues to circulate and all evidence points to the fact that we'll it will continue to do so and will potentially cause waves of an increased number of cases uh, at points in the future. This is particularly of concern as we head into the coming fall and winter season. Of course, we reported last week health experts okayed a second booster shot for people age 50 and older. Shortly after that decision, Dr. Mark said that another round of boosters will likely be needed in the fall. Well, tonight, a Detroit neighborhood is on edge as a suspected arsonist remains on the loose. The crime happened last month on Lawton Street near Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard. This is a surveillance video. As you see, their male suspect walks up to a black 2008 Dodge Caliber and just sets it on fire. Police say he may have suffered burns himself on his arms and face while committing this crime. If you know anything, please call Detroit Police or Crime Stoppers. That number, 1-800-SPEAK-UP.